Welcome all you football crazy people from near and far. In case you didn't know, you're watching Football Fanatics. There comes a time in every professional athlete's career where things don't seem to work out as planned. They seem to have lost their mojo, so to speak. The things they could have done quite simply and at ease before seem to have become so difficult to achieve. Paul Pogba seems to be in that predicament at the moment. In his second stint at Manchester United, the team would appear to be doing better without him. They sit second in the Premiership and Pogba's playing time relegated to not even being picked in the team. This is a time where a manager would give his talisman a much needed pep talk and get him to shake off the blues. But if he is waiting for that from the not so special one, my dear boy, don't hold your breath. My advice would be to go back to when you first started playing the game. When you were a child, when the ball was your favorite toy and kicking it was your favorite joy. When you played for the pure love of the game. Forget man who and the not so special one. You are Paul Pogba, under 20 World Cup winner with France in 2013, winner of the Young Player Award in the World Cup in 2014. All of France is depending on you for the World Cup in Russia this year. So get yourself together. Let's go win that World Cup. Remember, form is temporary, but class is permanent. And you are one of the classiest players in the game today. And for any of you players going through a similar predicament, the advice is the same. Go back to that time when you enjoyed the game the most, when you played it just for fun. And remember, don't think you can. No, you can. Thanks for watching. Well, that's all for now. But next time, we're looking at the most lethal striker in World Cup history. I bet you can't tell me who it is. Hint, hint. <laughs> anyway, don't forget to leave a like, a subscribe, a comment below saying whether you like it or you don't like it, or something I could do better, or something you'd actually like to see on Football Fanatics. Take care and remember, we're in a World Cup here. We're counting on the days. Less than a hundred years ago, people and we'll be now ugly. You're watching Football Fanatics.